Hello, today we're going to create a Vokey. Uh, to create a Vokey, we're going to go to www.vokey.com. I have it up on our screen here already. Uh, once we're on the web page to create our Vokey, we're just going to click on the Create button. Now this is going to load a random Vokey. So uh, you can use the random Vokey, but today we're going to create our own. Uh, to do that, we're going to click on this little image of like a bust. It's going to open up. And since I'm a male, I'm going to just search for male characters. And then we can click through our different categories here. I'm going to go over, I'm just going to click on classic. I'm going to select the one that I want. And he's going to load up on the side here. Once I have my character, I'm going to click on the hair beside the character icon. And it's going to allow me to click through and change the different styles of hair I want. I think I like this one here, so we're going to go with this one. Uh, next, we can uh, click here, and we can check for different hair styles if we want. Or we can just click on the lips and move on to the lips. And I've already looked through the lips, and I think the best one for me, we're going to go through and just stick with this one here and then for facial hair uh, we can add facial hair or we can take it away uh, for me I'm gonna go without I think it looks a little better without and then if we come over here to the color section we can actually change the colors of our mouth eyes skin and hair uh, I think my mouth the lips aren't quite red enough for me so let's add a little bit of color to them there we go the eyes I want them to be nice and bright blues skin tone a little tanner than that and then our hair uh, we can actually just select the colors from the bottom here uh, or we can keep going up into our palette and changing it that way and I have pretty dark hair so we're gonna go with that now we can also tweak the sizes of our mouth nose body our height and our width uh, to do that, we're just going to play with these little scrollers here. Go for a little bit smaller mouth. Stay about the same on the nose. Body can be really big or really small. I'm going to be right in the middle here. And we can get a longer face or a shorter. Fatter or skinnier. I think that looks good there. Next we can go up and we can actually change our Vokey's clothing. Now since we can't really see his clothing that well, we can actually click on him and drag him up. So I'm going to drag him up to the top of the screen here. And I actually, we can go through and look at the different ones here, but I like this one here, the costumes. I'm going to do our little white suit with the white, sh or the white suit with the blue shirt. And then I'm going to look at our hats and we can put on a hat if we want to. Get him a construction hat or a cowboy hat here. I'm going to stick without one today. Then we can go over to bling to add on any jewelry or sunglasses. We go down. I like these here. We're going to put those on him. Then we can add some bling, some, some nice Mr. T chain there. Then once we're done, uh, customizing we can just click on done it's going to take us back to our main view here now there's a few things that we can do here uh, we can give him a voice now we can call in uh, with a cellular phone or any any phone uh, and record our voice directly through the phone or we can type in a message or we can if you have a microphone on your computer you can record straight from your computer or if you have a file that you would want to use you can upload a file Today we're just going to use the keyboard. To do that, we'll click on the little T key. That's going to bring up our type, your text, and we're going to just type in "Hello, I am a Vokey," and we can test that to see how it sounds. Hello. All right, that's cool. We can use Paul's voice, or you can just click here and scroll down through and use a different voice. So let's see, 
what other ones we have here. Let's see, maybe we'll change it to Simon from the UK and see how he sounds. So you can see that it does have a little bit of a different accent. Uh, we're going to, let's stick with, um, we'll stick with Simon for now. We can click done here and that's going to save our voice in there. Now we can go and change the background because that, you know, that background, not that good looking. And with this, we can pick one of their backgrounds that they have and they have many different categories. Or if you have an image from your computer that you want to use, like uh, an awesome beach picture, you can select that image and upload it and it'll put the, that background in for you. We can click through and see what, what different ones. Uh, he doesn't look like a guy that would be out in the jungle. Kind of. That one looks kind of cool. We'll keep. We'll keep that one. And then, one of the last things you do before you finish is that you can change the the player that you have. Um, so it's just the color of the player. So we can click here on players. And it's going to give you a load of different players to choose from. Let's go with the black player for our Voki here. And then once you have everything set up and you view your Voki and you like how it looks, you can also test the sound one more time. Oh, ours isn't playing. So let's go back and see what, what happened with our voice. All right. All right, since our Vokey's finished, we can actually just click on Publish now. And we're going to give our Vokey a name. And uh, we'll just do, I'm just going to name mine Tutorial. If I can type here. And we'll save that. Now this is going to create your Vokey, so you can upload it to uh, Facebook, you can upload it to MySpace. Or you can, if you have a blog, you can embed the, the code into your blog. Uh, you can use it for many things. Uh, so our scene's been created and saved here, so I'm going to just close that. And you can see here, you can just click on Facebook, MySpace, Twitter, and you can upload them directly to uh, your accounts there. Or if you want to use uh, it in like your blog or your website, you can actually embed your code into your website. Or you can actually just select if you want to have it on a link through Vokey.com. You can click on here and just do like your standard Vokey link or your Symbolu Vokey link. And that will give you a link that you can send people to to view your Vokey. Uh, you can also change the size of your Vokey if you want it to be smaller or larger uh, before you make any of these changes here. All right, that's creating a Vokey. Uh, I hope this has helped you create your Vokey. Uh, if if you do have any questions, you can always post on my blog at jms355.weebly.com, uh, and I'd be more than happy to help you out. Have a good day.